The story of a six-year-old running the full Flying Pig Marathon made headlines across the globe. And now his parents are telling their side in a unique way. Local 12's James Pilcher sat down with Father Ben Crawford today and joins us live in studio. Hi, James. Hey, Morella. Yeah, the Crawfords are taking the story of Rainier's run to the big screen this weekend with a full-length documentary to be shown at a local movie theater. And the nearly 90-minute movie shows both the highs and the lows of the experience. How you feeling? Good. I'm not sure if I'm ready, though. Yeah? Well, are you going to be able to go for it? Filming footage of six-year-old son Rainier running his first flying pig in May was nothing new for the Crawfords, who have done the same for most of their kids. It was only after the explosion in media coverage and online backlash did Ben Crawford decide to turn it into a movie. I just really wanted to show our side of the story so that people can see and then decide for themselves what they think the pros and cons of doing something, which is arguably pretty crazy, Crawford provided Local 12 an advance copy of the movie and gave us permission to show clips. The documentary features interviews with the Crawford family, including Rainier's five older siblings. His mother, Cammie, expresses doubt about the enterprise beforehand and having the authorities called. Child Protective Services later would indeed investigate. It's triply abnormal to run 26 miles with your six-year-old. I'm nervous. This is hard. I hope that they don't call CPS. The movie shows the rough moments when Rainier falls and cries. The parents also give him liquid Tylenol during the race. But it also shows the joy at finishing and getting the medal he really craved. Crawford bristles at those who say he is only using his kids for self-promotion. And those kids deserve it. They earned it. They chose it. They accomplished it. They ran the marathon. And I want them to see a theater full of people to watch what they did. I think they deserve that. One key moment in the movie is from after previous races when Flying Pig race director Iris Bush Simpson Bush gives the young girls, Rainier's sister, their medals for finishing before this race. I asked Ben Crawford about how the Flying Pig organizers handled the situation this year. He said he was very disappointed and he doesn't know if he wants to run the race again. But he says all the kids really do want to, so they may be back. And Crawford isn't sure what he'll do with the movie after Sunday's premiere, but said it will be posted online for somewhere for all to watch. Back to you guys. Thank you, James. And if you are interested in going to the movie, tickets are $8 and can be purchased on the Marymount Theater website or in person at the door starting at 7. A link is available inside this story on our website, local12.com.